Right now, Chief Meteorologist John Bryant with the Mid-South Certified Most Accurate Forecast. All right, well, right now, this is what you need to know. Rain chances are increasing and will be in the coming days. Muggy the rest of the week. Humidity is um, up there. Late summer standards. Don't want that. Temps are above average as well. Those are your really big uh, three elements of our weather story tonight. No rain right now anyway, but it's going to be picking up as we get into Wednesday and Thursday and perhaps Friday and Saturday for that matter. Take a look at the uh, computer model here in a second. It's 78 right now in Memphis, so it is a warm night for late September as we approach October, these last few days of September. Check this map out right here. You see the green? Both of those areas are coming in our direction, so it's just kind of a preview of what's to come. 69, the overnight low, we might not even fall below 70 in Memphis. 69 with a southeast wind and about a 10% chance of rain overnight, and moisture will continue to increase from the Gulf tomorrow and give us a chance of showers. So this pattern is setting up. And it's going to stick around for a while, actually longer than usual for this time of the year. 10 o'clock tonight, 75 degrees. Watch what happens overnight. Clouds continue to thicken up and uh, even some rain chances tomorrow morning. Notice uh, not high rain chances. This is early in the day, 6 a.m. But as the day goes along, rain chances are going to pick up. There's going to be so much humidity out there uh, that everybody has a chance at a shower. This is at noon and even into the afternoon. Notice more showers pop up. Doesn't mean it's going to rain all day in any one spot, but uh, we do have higher opportunities for rain. So get the umbrella back out. Have it handy, keep it handy, because we're going to have numerous rain chances in the coming days. Uh, 9 o'clock tomorrow night, about 24 hours from right now, there will be showers on the radar. And as we get into Thursday, look for additional chances and opportunities for rain. This is at 1 o'clock Thursday afternoon. Notice the red that indicates the heavier rain, uh, the reds and the yellows, but it's not going to rain in any one spot all day over the next several days. Just be ready uh, at any point for showers, especially in the afternoon and evenings um, and late night. The chances for rain will go down uh, as we lose the uh, sun's energy uh, at night. All right, seven day outlook. Shows highs in the 80s all the way across until next Tuesday. That's when we get a cold front. That's when we go back to fall, uh, but it's going to be muggy for a while. Hey, text me your fall picks 321-7520, even though it does feel right now uh, like summer again. Uh, text me your Halloween stuff, whatever. Check this out, corn maze at the Ag Center. That's about to get going. If it not already is, it might have started today, actually. Need to double check that, but there's a, just a little preview but humidity, Rudy, got to deal with that for a few days. I know, I know. And speaking of that, I know that's corn, but that always reminds me of the shining. You know, that was a oh, snow yeah. maze, snow and ice maze. So when you talk about humidity, that's going to feel like the real summer out there in the middle of all that corn, all those stuff. It really is. Mm. It's, it's going to feel like summer again. But hopefully by Halloween, it'll feel chilly enough to be in costumes and that sort of thing. I hope so. <laughs> Halloween, yeah. All right, everybody. Why could it take longer to get into